I'm Judy Collins, and I'm here to talk about my fourth album, which is called The Judy Collins Concert, and tell you something about it. It was 1964. That was the year that I went to Mississippi to register voters and traveled with Barbara Dane and sang and traveled with Fannie Lou Hamer, the wonderful woman who was the head of the Mississippi Freedom Party, which was presented at the 1964 Democratic Convention. You can go online and see all about that and what happened politically to her because uh, Lyndon Johnson did not want to see her on television presenting the Democratic Party, Freedom Party. However, that year I decided to do my first solo concert at Town Hall with an ensemble that included Bob Bob Shelton, who was the reviewer of that concert, and Chuck Israels, who played the bass, and Bob Sylvester, who played the cello, and um, a wonderful group of artists who played uh, Steve Mandel on the p on the on the on the uh, guitar and the banjo, and me, of course, on the on the guitar, and it was an exciting night because we decided to record it. We just had that one night to do, and. The material on the album were songs that I had worked on and performed and tried to work up so I could do them at Town Hall without so many hitches. And it had been the first time I'd presented songs of Billy Ed Wheeler's on this album, a song called Winter Sky, and um, of course The Lonesome Death of Hattie Carroll, which is the Bob Dylan song about the death of this maid in a hotel in Baltimore who was uh, killed by um, just a raging drunk, probably, in the, in the Baltimore Hotel. And uh, it was a, an important song to do at that point. Also, Tom Paxton's songs were on this album. I'd recorded some of them before, but this time I got to do Rambling Boy. I was living in the village, and I'd go down and walk around the streets, and I'd run into Tom on the street, and he'd say, you know, I just, I just wrote this new song. Uh, um, Bottle of wine, fruit on the vine. And I think I recorded that here. I think so. Yeah, bottle of wine is on here. And uh, Rambling Boy of Tom Paxton's. Oh, Cold Tattoo is another song of Billy Ed Wheeler. One of the great protest songs of all time about losing your job out of a coal mine. And this was 1964. He also wrote a beautiful, beautiful song, which I don't think I recorded here, but I did later. Um, now that our mountains are burning, a uh, beautiful, beautiful song of, of uh, Wheeler's. Anyway, it was kind of a, a groundbreaking album, and as I said, it was my first solo album in New York at, Car at uh, Town Hall, and so now you get to enjoy it and hear it perhaps for the very first time.